right in slope intercept form and graph. Let's go ahead and work through it. Solution. So the slope intercept form is y equals mx plus b. So our goal is to write it this way and then use m, which is the slope, and 0 comma b, which is the y-intercept, to graph this line. So we have to basically solve for y. So one way to do it maybe is to start by adding the 5y. That way we can make the uh, 5 here positive. So let's go, let's go ahead and do that. So plus 5y plus 5y. So this will be 2x equals 5y. And we're almost there. We just need to solve for y. So now we can go ahead and divide by 5. And we're dividing because it's being multiplied by 5. So it's like the inverse operation. So we have 2x over 5 equals y. Now, you can write this backwards, right? You can write it as y equals 2x over 5. But this is the same thing as y equals 2 fifths times x, right? Because you're really multiplying it um, by x over 1. And that's the same thing as x. And when you do that, you do 2 times x. And so that gives you 2x up top. And 5 times 1 gives you 5 on the bottom. So 2 fifths times x is the same as 2x over, over 5. OK, in this case, it looks like there is no y-intercept, right? Because it's just plus 0. So our b is 0. So our y-intercept, if you look over here on the left, the x is always 0. So the b is 0. So it's just going to be 0, 0. And our slope is m. So that'll be 2 over 5. We can think of this as rise over run. So let's go ahead and attempt to do a graph. So we'll draw our axes. There's the y-axis and there's the x-axis. And let's see, we start at 0, 0, so start at the y-intercept. And we're going to rise 2 and run 5. So we'll go up 2, and then we'll go over 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and put a dot. So rise 2, run 5, and then just connect the dots. And then there we have our line. I hope this video has been helpful.